Excuse me, is the seat taken? No, I'll go ahead. Okay, thanks. irritating tv tv in general and i say tv because i grew up watching tv i think i've learned everything from every tv show that i've ever watched i go out in public i apply that knowledge and then somebody comes up to me and says you know what you watch way too much tv so i cut, try to cut back on tv and then i'm getting a job selling tvs so now i have to go to work and tell people why they should get better tvs and I don't even really care about TVs. And the main part that I don't even care about TVs, there's several reasons. First of all, I never get to watch TV because I'm at work selling TVs for 12 hours a day. Secondly, they make me learn all this crap about TVs that nobody should ever care about. But it's like you say, okay, you come home, you watch this, this, this TV station. They say, you ever notice how great digital is? No, because I have an analog TV. I know nothing about digital TV until I start seeing these digital TV commercials. And then they're telling me that I got to go buy another TV so that I can watch TV the way they want me to do it. And I said, no, I'm going to ignore that for like three and a half years until they finally decide, you know what, next year, we're going to make you get a better TV because we're going to cut off the signal. So now I have to go get a brand new TV so that I can watch TV when I don't even get to watch TV now. That's just in case I decide I want to watch it. So, okay, so I'm at work telling people that story on top of why they should buy a bigger and better TV, 1080p. You should get a 1080p TV. And have you seen the commercials for 1080p TV? If you're at home watching 480p, which is standard definition, you can't tell the difference. Why? Because you're watching it in standard definition. They can't show you high definition on a standard definition TV, but they flash the commercials anyway. Come get this new, see the difference. You can't see the difference because there is no difference. You can't show something better on something that's not better. It's the same. The same thing. The same exact thing. Pushing it down my throat, and it's so, so I get out of work, I'm like, I want to take a break, I just want to watch a movie, go rent a movie, and I take it home, sit down, lo and behold, now I can finally see the difference because I am studying something I don't care about. I'm watching a movie, I'm just going to get through it, it's a documentary or whatever it's going to be, and, and the whole time I'm thinking in my head, boy, if this was on the 52-inch, 65-inch, 1080p TV at work, it'd be a lot better. So then I take the movie to work, and I put it in so I can see what it looks like, and I get in trouble. I'm not supposed to be watching TV, I'm supposed to be selling TVs so that I can rack up points so I can get discounts on direct TV even though I don't have time to watch it. I mean, TV is starting to revolve my right, I mean, oh jeez. And then, what's up with all the reality television shows? If people stop, stop spending so much time watching reality TV, they can actually get to reality. The reality TV shows aren't even realistic. When was the last time you went on a date with five people? I don't think that anybody ever has a life like that. Nobody ever gets to go and roll a car or drive an army tank or just jump out of an airplane because you get a random note from some guy dressed up in a stupid costume. It never happens in everyday life. And so we turn to reality TV to give us our reality. And then you turn on the computer to get away from TV and download TV shows. Because there's no writers for regular TV. That's why there's so much reality TV because you're taking all the jobs out of it. <sighs> now it's like... Just turn on the camera and record something. Get on a computer and watch YouTube because there's nothing good on TV. And um, are you kidding me with freaking commercials? Videos have commercials now? That's the whole reason I got the internet. I don't have cable because I don't want to watch what's on cable because I've already seen it. I grew up watching it for 20 years. It's doing all reruns and then it's all reality TV show when I have my own reality. So I have my choice between reality TV and reruns. Get on a computer to watch something on YouTube or some other download network and I'm getting freaking commercials. Are you kidding me? Commercials on the internet? I don't pay for this. I pay so I can get away from commercials that are telling me to go buy a new 1080 TV. <sighs> Even at the movies, there's commercials. Um, if I'm at the movie theater and I'm trying to watch Cloverfield, I don't want to buy a new car. I don't want to buy a new SUV. If I wanted to buy an SUV, I wouldn't be at the movie theater. I would be at the car dealership looking at an SUV. <sighs> TV is starting to get out of control.